Yeah, very good evening to everyone. Uh, I am Dr. A. R. Balamurugan, consultant physician, come diabetologist, uh, practicing at Sosum uh, Specialty Clinic, Kolathur, Chennai. The topic for discussion today is: uh, Has technology played a role in uh, diabetes management? Yes, absolutely. Uh, the term uh, technology used to describe the uh, hardwares, softwares, and uh, devices that people with diabetes mellitus uh, used to help manage their uh, uh, conditions from lifestyle to blood glucose levels. Because uh, this is a era of modern, modern era of uh, social media like uh, Facebook, uh, YouTube, in Instagrams, and WhatsApp, and uh, Twitter. Everything is available. Uh, the all these outset, uh, the technology has to grow. With the, to cope up with the patient's management, because 30 years ago there is no uh, glucometer. Okay, the, you have to draw blood from the venous sample and do a, a blood sugar level uh, to find out the blood sugars by calorimetry method, and then uh, finally uh, semi-auto analysis and uh, auto analysis are uh, came in the market. In latest uh, technologies uh, to find out. Uh, and uh, about the blood sugars and the management of diabetes is uh, uh, self uh, continuous uh, glucose monitoring devices that's very much useful because uh, glucose is uh, blood sugar is constantly changing according to the stress environment and everything uh, lifestyle uh, through the exercise we should know uh, what is happening exactly inside the body and uh, when we have to increase the insulin dosage and uh, whether we have to increase the short acting insulin or uh, long acting insulin so that, that continuous glucose monitoring devices is very much helpful. Uh, then it has some kind of a sensor and uh, other uh, device to attach in the arm to back of the arm. And uh, with the help of Bluetooth, we can find out uh, it will trigger the alarming trigger. It has some alarming trigger, trigger factors. Uh, the mobile in the mobiles we can know the exact blood sugar value in the uh, every minute. Uh, four times it is uh, uh, calculating the blood sugars. That means uh, 24 hours we can uh, continuously can monitor the blood sugars. The latest other options are uh, insulin pumps. It has some kind of uh, uh, sensors, uh, very much useful uh, to find out, especially in the case of uh, type 1 diabetes mellitus in the young patients and then uh, uh, brittle diabetes because in this there will be more fluctuation there in the brittle diabetes and type 1 diabetes. So, uh, in the era of modern uh, uh, era, uh, the help of insulin pumps and continuous glucose monitoring, insulin pens, syringe, and everything will uh, find out the exact blood sugar's value and uh, will come to know that uh, uh, to the exact situation of uh, diabetes and we can manage the diabetes mellitus. Some certain apps are there. Uh, it will help to uh, indicate and uh, give alarm to the consultant physician and diabetologist regarding the low sugar value or uh, abnormal excess sugar value. Uh, so they will uh, they can titrate the insulin or uh, oral medications. Uh, so a lot of apps are available. Software are available like uh, Google Fit and other uh, fitness apps. Other apps are available. So latest uh, Google and Apple Watch uh, have uh, more uh, kind of. Uh, uh, detecting the problems in which diabetes already they have a solution uh, for the arrhythmias. I think uh, we all know that uh, single leads like we can find out uh, whether atrial fibrillation is there or not. It will connect to the consultant physician, it will give the alarm. Uh, if the patient falls or uh, some have chest pain or rhythm changes, in the meantime, the future diabetes uh, control will be like uh, other lot. A lot of options are available because of smart, smartphones control diabetic devices like Tandem's mobile uh, bolusing and uh, new Tandem uh, T-Sport mini pump and Omnipod 5 other devices. Uh, insulin pumps in the form of uh, Medtronic company and XCOM G7 uh, uh, GM and then other uh, about uh, freestyle liver you can find out. Uh, other uh, connected insulin pins uh, with the help of Bluetooth and everything. So, so the, all the help, help of uh, technology and uh, these new devices. We can control the diabetes mellitus uh, because uh, it, will cause, it will prone to cause both uh, microvascular and macrovascular complication because of uh, in the very near future, we'll uh, beat the China to become number one in the world uh, in the diabetes population. So to prune the morbidity and mortality, uh, to, to, have, uh, to prune the morbidity and mortality and other uh, hospital expenses. So exact uh, diagnosis and uh, treatment of diabetes is most important. So the insulin pumps, 
insulin pens syringes and uh, continuous glucose monitoring this kind of uh, devices is very much useful in the near future so thank you for the patient listening thank you